So this is the entrance to the excavation site there, that's where I am. That, that's where I am, the entrance is just there. So that's where Olin is, the City of the Sun, enter excavation site. That's the campfire you can save at, and that's the one I've just saved at. But every time you load from a save, all the robots come back and all the guards come back, so just be aware of that. Also, I wouldn't do it any other time than daylight, because at night it's virtually impossible to see them. So let's just run down here and do them over We're with this attack. lance. You'll find if you alert all that over there, all the robots and guards, they will come over and see what the problem is, oh, so you'll have to kill all them as well. Let's get the right arrow ready, there we go. We're all loaded up, ready to go. So this is the entrance here. Let's go ahead and climb. So you climb up this, these ledges, then you can search this box. So just crouch down and it's going to go to a cutscene just around this corner. So don't shoot anyone from up here because there's a ramp there and what happens is the robots come up and kill you. So the way I've done it is I go over this round the back of here, stay low, they don't know where you are at the moment. You can kill all three of these cultists up here first and you can do it without alerting the whole camp. but. It gets quite difficult because you've got to shoot quite a distance. That's the first one. very difficult to see even with focus. There is another person. At the moment no one's seen me. There's the next one. Could probably go to the next section. Still staying crouched. You can actually fire see through the net. It's 
wait for my focus to fill back up. The Nora girl lives. Kill her! No, you had to change. That's it, he's finished. So let's get my fire arrows ready. Two out of three is not bad. Powered arrows, fire arrows, they do their job. Now just concentrate on the robots. It's good when they're flailing because you can keep firing at them. Just come back when you're getting corrupted. Wait for my armor to build back up. Longer distance is better. You don't create as much damage, but you don't risk getting killed either. One of them down there is only. Should be it, there we go. Let's just do some more arrows. So that's 60 gone. So we can get them down in the same place. The second one doesn't seem to be as strong as the first. Go, they're both down. So let's go ahead and get down there without dropping down and killing ourselves. So if you want, you can collect all the stuff before the cutscene because if you don't, it disappears. That's part of the gl a glitch in the game. That'll do. <laughs> I was going to run all the way around, but what I'm going to do now go and collect all the goodies before the cutscene. There's the next one. There is actually log traps. Show you what they do if you want to put them into your attack you can do but I did find the first time round through this game it was a lot harder with a rubbish bow and without the boosted I think you came for me I'm ready no space no, I'm still going and looking you'll have to wait Olin hear me out which obviously now you've walked past him I'll keep calling you I think that's everything collected. So obviously if you don't collect the stuff before the cutscene, you will lose everything when it comes back. So let's go ahead. That's it, so let's go and talk to Olin now. I promise, I'll tell you everything. I know you will. 
The killers who came for me at the prison, who are they? The Eclipse. Some kind of holy warriors. A cult of the Shadow Karja. Shadow Karja? Except they're not like any Karja I've known. They don't pray to the sun. They worship some kind of devil. I'm not interested in their superstitions. Oh, it's not a superstition. Their devil is real. It has a name, a voice, the most terrible voice, and they do its bidding. You say this devil, the Eclipse Worship, has a name? Hades. That's what they call it. Hades. And you've heard it speak? Steal to my soul. I heard just once when it saw you. Such a voice. A cold, awful jangle that scrapes your bones, that hollows your guts. A metal sound, but like nothing dug from the earth or smelted in a forge. And what did it say? System threat detected. Just three words, but in the voice of a devil. What are these Eclipse cultists after besides me? They never said. But given the Karja civil war, they must want to overthrow Sun King of Ard and take Meridian back. What do I have to do with that? I don't know. When they attacked the Proving, a man came for me. Tall, strong, dead eyes. He is. And who is he? The Terror of the Sun. Stacker of corpses, we Osram called him, when he was the Mad Sun King's champion. If only he'd died with his king. But now he leads the Eclipse. I tell you, he's the most dangerous man alive. How did the Eclipse recruit you? I know they took your family hostage, but why you? I was a scrounger, a rummager in dark places, good at what I do. I suppose they knew I would serve them well as a scout. I had taken a delve near Maker's End. When I surfaced, they were waiting. I laughed when I saw the priest, but then he showed me Helis's encouragement. I didn't laugh after that. They gave me a focus to watch my every move. I followed orders. You had access to Meridian. Why didn't they get to Avad through you? Too much dirt under my nails for an audience with the one true Sun King. But whatever Ursa or Aaron told me, the Eclipse heard every word through my focus. That's why I couldn't warn you. If I tried, they would have killed my family. Why are the Eclipse digging up ancient machines? And how do they get them to work? I thought they wanted them for scrap, but they brought them back to life. Plugged some kind of device into the corpses so that Hades could whisper to them and call them from their grave. I've fought that kind of machine before. Are there others? Yes. The ones you fought today they call Corruptors, but there are others. Much bigger, bristling with ancient weapons. Those they call Deathbringers. I've only seen them buried in the ground, but after today, anything is possible. Sounds to me like they're raising an army. If so, the world will fall, and I helped dig the pit. The Eclipse were sent to kill me because I look like another woman. Older, maybe twice my age, short hair. Who is she? I don't know. My focus found her image once, in the ruins of Maker's End. Maybe you can find her there. You found her image in the ruins? How? There was a door beside it, a kind of ancient device that contained the woman's image. My focus recorded the location. You do look like her. Is she your mother? I'm the one asking questions. I've heard enough. It's time to finish this. I won't beg for my life. But if there's any mercy in you, free my family. Please. Where would I find them? My focus recorded the location. There are always guards there. You look like you can handle yourself. So last time I didn't kill him, but this time I'm going to kill him. And I'll write in the comments below if it changes the game in any way. So I'm not going to redeem him. Your life is forfeit. I know you committed your crimes to save your family. But because of your crimes, dozens were murdered. Dozens of families were destroyed. My own included. I can't let you live. I'm sorry. 
Please, my family, don't tell them what I did. So, you're ready then? To answer for what I've done, the lives I've ruined. Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> So that one's completed, it's saved. I'd have to ditch something. So there's nothing collectible from Olin. So that's it guys. I'll just give you a quick look at what my the bow I use is. So this is the bow I use. That's the the hit points so the modifications are 38% fire coil 37% fire coil and 30% fire coil so that's it guys so thanks for watching this longer video I I, I went through all the cutscenes and all the options so uh, thanks for watching and check back soon cheers <laughs>